Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Nicole, of course. Now, if you guys are new here, please go ahead and check out the subscribe button down below. Hit that button to the... Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Nicole, of course. Now, if you guys are new here, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. Also, click that notification bell to get notified every single time that I post here on my channel. Now, you guys, listen, it is late at night. Well, late for me, but I usually get my videos done way, way earlier in the morning and I got hungry. So, I cooked up a meal. Unfortunately, I did not record it this time but I feel like I did a good job I know it looks very very small on this plate but I do have a story time to show you guys and I will show you up close so it's my first time cooking um collard greens and I use turkey necks I have some asparagus a steak under there and then right over here are some mashed potatoes mmm Okay, wait, maybe I should get a, th a thumbnail real quick. Okay, so listen, it's, like I said, later at night, and I was like, I'm not going to film the cooking portion of this, but I will eat it for you guys in front of the camera because, like I said, I have the news that I cooked the collard greens by myself. Jalen showed me how to do it one night when she was over. We were having a girls, a girls' night, so I did it. And as I was taste testing it, I'm sorry, it's really hot in here. I've been cooking like for a couple of hours, so let me just catch my breath real quick. Woosa! I did a thumbnail. Let me pray, and then we can start chit chatting. Father God, I want to thank you for this food, and please bless this food in Jesus' name. We pray. So yeah, I've started out with the greens and then I was at the store I was supposed to just get the greens and then I was at the store and I seen this steak and I was like oh I have some asparagus at home so I grabbed some potatoes whipped this up it took a couple of hours because you know I boiled the turkey lay uh, the turkey necks and then put in the greens which this time I made a lot of and as I was saying I as I was taste testing it because they're not supposed to be crunchy that's how you know that they're not done um, I thought they were pretty good so I'm gonna have to do a video on this mmm I like them only thing is when Jalen made them they were like really really spicy so I'm gonna add, I'm gonna have to add more spice. Shania being Shania tonight. Um, I literally was setting up and I would like quickly go, you know, around the island or to grab my camera or whatever. She's chasing after me. Like if I, she's so scared that I'm gonna go somewhere, I'm like Shania. All I hear is her little bell and then her feet slip on the floor like she can't get a grip. And I'm like, Shania, I'm not going anywhere. It's okay. She's being really, really funny tonight. So. Mm. I do have a story that happened to me. Well, not to me, but I'll explain it in a little bit. This is really good. I think I did, I personally think I did a good job. Um, I would like to cook this for somebody else, you know, Dalvin or Jalen, and have them taste test it. Now, if you have me on Snap or Instagram, I did post some videos on my story. Mm. I'm thinking, it's really good but 
I feel like everybody thinks that their food tastes really good, so <laughs> I definitely need someone else to try it out and let me know. Mmm. Hold on, wait. Wait a second. I have a ribeye steak and literally hold on this is honestly I was a little bit like iffy about the steak I wasn't sure if I cooked it the correct way I did put it in the oven I don't know if you're really supposed to do that or not I was just like you know I'm just gonna try this out I don't have a grill I don't own a grill which I want to get one for the summertime and stuff but I think this is really good it's not dry I put a little bit of um chicken broth in it in the pot in the pan um as it was cooking not too much and then I put some onions in there I of course seasoned it and let it sit for a couple of hours I'm shocked I'm shocked I'm not saying it's the best steak in the world but I just thought it was going to be more dry rather than, you know, have still flavor in there. Mmm. Mm-hmm. 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 Mmm. This is good. I know it's bad to have you know coca-cola but um i just have to with like a meal like this now next time i do have to say i will break up the greens a lot more for some reason i thought they would just like kind of fall apart more but they stayed whole so i have like bigger leaves so that's another thing that I would have to work on, you know, the next time that I make this. Mmm. And then, of course, definitely put some more spice into it. Mmm. Mmm, 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 mmm. Also, I did add a little bit of garlic to the potatoes. My plan was to have, you know, whole potatoes, like when we would do a seafood boil, but then I just turned them into mash. I was like, you know what? I think people call these dirty mashed potatoes because the skin is still on them. Mm. I am so shocked, you guys. Like, I'm not trying to toot my own horn at all, but I'm just shocked that it came out decent at least, you know. Mm. I gave Shania the string. I don't know if I said this or not, but no. She still has a string. It's just a shoe, a shoe string. But you remember from the McDonald's video, I got 22 as in the in the Happy Meal. I got 22 as the toy. She plays with it all the time. <clears throat> I had it stuck somewhere. I can't remember where I put it. And one night. Not one night. One day, I left and came back, and it was out, and she was playing with it. I was like, okay, I guess. <laughs> like, it's just a little stuffed animal toy thing. Mm hmm But, okay. So, 
Hold on. <laughs> You guys have to be careful because with the turkey necks, the bones in there, and you cook it with the bone until the meat falls off. Thought she was ripping up my couch. So you know, you if you well, I'm sure you guys know, but if you don't, you um you know cook the the turkey necks until the meat is like falling off the bone, and then you add the, the grains to it. So just be careful for the bones. I just had an issue with that but so um as I was coming back from the grocery store I noticed that one of my neighbors their car door was open and I was like okay that's weird and I was as I was pulling up I thought someone was like you know getting out or or you know doing something by their car and I was like okay like whatever so I put the bags back in the house or I bring I brought the bags in the house and then I also bought two waters and those are really heavy so I have to take one you know each by itself so I was coming in and out of the house and then I noticed no one's by the car I was like what is going on maybe they just ran upstairs or whatever to their apartment somewhere and they went to go grab something or whatever it may be and so I bring in the first uh, bottle of water <clears throat> and I'm like okay like I'm sure they'll be right back down to get in their car or do whatever they need to do come back out To grab the second bottle of water or case of water I should say <clears throat> and no one's there again and I'm just like sitting here like okay this is really odd because if I remember right I think I know whose car this is like once I've seen them a couple of times and they're older so I'm like okay could something be wrong you know I just felt like very odd about it I was like the doors just open and no one's around it's weird so as I put back the second case of water in my house I locked my door and went to the office I was like hey um like I'm not trying to be in anybody's business because you know some people like they'll be right back or whatever but it was just so odd to me I was like I'm not trying to be in anybody's business or anything but I'm just trying to look out um the car over there has their door open and it's been like that for a while and it was like okay thank you for letting me know <clears throat> so I go back to my house and I'm thinking like oh by the way before I went to go tell the office I knocked on my one of my neighbor's doors and because I thought that was that's where they lived but apparently not they live like in a total different area and I was like hey um mind you this is my first time speaking to like any of my neighbors whatsoever and I'm just awkward with people when I first meet them so or introduce myself so I, uh, I knock on the door and then I just stand back and they're coming to the door and he he's like hi I was like hey um I'm just wondering if that car over there is yours because the door is just open and no one's around he was like oh no that's not mine um that's the person that I over there oh, Shania is messing with so much stuff right now mm. anyways um I was like oh okay so I went to go knock on the person's door whose car it was and I knock and there's dogs barking whatever but no one answers the door so I wait I knock I step back wait a little bit 
and I'm just like, okay, maybe they're, you know, in a different room and they didn't hear the knock or something, whatever. So I knock one more time. I wait a little bit, like a couple seconds. And then I finally, um, that light from the TV just freaked me out. <sighs> Sorry, I'm so distracted. Let me get to this. So I wait a little bit more. No one answers the door. And um, I, I go back to, no, that's when I went to the office and I was like, hey, I'm not trying to be in nobody's business, but like, look, la, 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 whatever. He's like, okay. So, you know, I go back in my house. I start to wash the greens. I called my dad. We chatted for a little bit, caught up, um, just remembered some old memories, yada, yada, yada. And then I was just curious. I was like, hmm, I wonder if, you know, anybody. Oh, by the way, my dad said that I should call the cops just to do like a wellness check on them. But I figured the office people would do that because I just, I don't want to be in people's business. Like once again, like, I don't know. But I just figured like the, the apartment people would do it and, um, And that's that. So hold on. I'm slipping off my chair. So let me just start to eat a little bit because I'm just, I feel like I'm doing too much. this bite so I go back in my house start cooking and then you know I was just curious because I think I seen the office guy walk past my window and I was like, hmm, I wonder if, you know, he got in contact with the person whose door was open yet. Still wasn't, um, it was still open. And uh, if I just look out my door, I can see the car. And I'm like, hmm, like maybe something bad. It, it, it. What ran through my mind right away was like um, someone was getting out of their car and like I, I do watch a lot of movies, so I'm sure. Oh my gosh, if this did happen, I, I am glad I'm the one that spoke up about, you know, their door being open or whatever. But what ran through my mind was like someone getting in their car or out of their car and then they were like, just take it. You know, that's just, that was like the first thing. So I was like, you know what, let me check on this, whatever. So I mean, probably, I don't know, hour, two hours pass and the door's still open. And I'm just like, okay, at this point, like, should I call? Should I do a wellness check? Or what? What should I do? And um, I'm just like, I'm just thinking to myself in my apartment. I'm like, okay, but. Mmm. Mmm. And then the guy passed again. Because I checked on the car during those two or three hours i kept on looking because i was like okay like did they find anybody yet and then um one of the times when i opened the door he was like oh yeah we got it like it was just some uh lady you know and i was like oh my goodness like thank thank god you know like i'm glad it's not something serious because I was like, you know, you don't want to just go close the door yourself because then I feel like you're just setting yourself up and you look suspicious. Like, even though you're just trying to be nice and close the door. Everything was running through my head at that moment. Um, but 
I'm glad I spoke up about it because you know their door could still be open right now and it's like dark outside and someone could just like ransack your car she had a lot of stuff in her car too well not a lot but you know like sunglasses and like a dog stuff or whatever I don't know but I'm just saying I'm glad I spoke up about it I don't know in my heart but I tried so I feel good about that but as I was cooking I was like oh I should tell them this story because honestly the last video was just hectic boring 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 honestly I wish things happened to me more often because truly stuff like that doesn't really happen I like I swear my life is so <laughs> my life is pretty much boring like nothing exciting happens I mean mm, like of course me doing YouTube and you guys and like with my mom and stuff but nothing like just random happens to me mmm so yeah that's my little story time that I have to tell you guys because I was just thinking about it Gosh, she's okay. It was nothing like major the way I thought of it. So everything's good. Mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. After this, honestly, I'm going to throw in some PJs and snuggle up with Shania, even though she's been bad. She's actually been really bad. <laughs> I mean, like, I don't punish her. The most I do is, like, squirt her with the, the spray bottle, but, like, lightly. But she, today when I was cooking, she would not stay off of the counter. And I was like, Shania, please, can you not do this anymore? No, she did it at least 10 times. And I was like, oh my goodness. Mm. guys have any any stories or anything that happened to you like that maybe you were just bringing up groceries and you forgot to close your car door I'm sure it was like something little like that Another thing is, I wonder if you guys can help me out with this. The turkey necks or the greens just in general, I feel like are very, very salty. So what can I put in there to 
kind of mask it or just make it even with some other seasoning it just makes me super duper thirsty <laughs> it's good but i need something because it's just like there like i am salty she showed up oh. All right, guys, I will see you tomorrow. You can always find me here on YouTube and Instagram at Nicole, of course, and on Snapchat, Twitter, TikTok, and Facebook. It's Nicole, of course, with two E's at the end. I love you guys so, 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 so much. I will see you tomorrow. Good night. Bye.